Hi everybody, this is Roxy and I'm just going to show you how to make some bows for your doggies and your babies and your cats and stuffed animals, whatever you want to put them on, bunnies. Um, the way I did them was with Velcro. So you just need one piece of Velcro. You know, these two are stuck together. But I just used, I think you buy these and Michael's wherever. And then I just cut them... Cut them in like little strips, like like about like cut this in thirds. Or right thereabouts. And then these will just go on the back of the dog. Or their hair. And the way to put them on is <clears throat> just to take a tuft of their hair and um, kind of twirl it. So that you can get Velcro on either side of the little tuft of hair. So then I just, you know, I just, um, this is sticky, sticky back Velcro and it works really well. And then I just covered the back. And I, you could use, I don't have white so I use black. So this is a bow that I do a lot. It's a double tail bow and I'll show you how to do it. It's super easy. And it helps you make a really nice bow. So start with about seven inches of your ribbon and then another five inches maybe. And with the longer one, just make a remembrance bow. Okay. And then pull this down. There, so you've got kind of a, almost a bow, and wrap this around. You can actually, there, you can even put it down on your surface, wrap it around, and I've got really inky fingers, so sorry. They look dirty, but they're just inky with permanent ink. And then when you pull this tail through, Try to turn it so that it, the pretty side is out if it's a one-sided ribbon. And then just pull it tight and it's going to look like a mess. And then you just work with your loops. Um, just keep in mind that your tightening ribbon is going to be in the front. Okay? So then if you want to make bigger loops, you can do that because that will pull the loop ribbon or the um, tails back out okay and then just keep tightening your tail tighten tail there and then just try to keep it down you can fold it down and just work with it until you get the bow that you like okay And just kind of move them around there okay then you can clip these however you want if if you want a fishtail you can clip them with fishtail ends and if they come loose you can just always tighten them with that um, the Titan Tails. Okay. And save these pieces <clears throat> for the back. Okay, I'm just going to kind of work it a little bit. There. Okay. And this is stiff ribbon. It's Dollar Tree ribbon, so it's not the most um, pliable. It's a little bit stiff, but it's still cute. Okay, then you just take one of your, the back off just one. Leave your Velcro together. Okay, take the back off and put it on the back of your bow. Like in the middle. Okay. And then I'm just going to cut a piece to fit the back. 
Okay. And then you can pull off the back um, thing, you know, the wrapper, and put that on the back. And it's done. And it, this is really good adhesive on the Velcro. So, like I did um, reinforce this with some glue, but you really don't have to. Because it's not going to come off. And there's your little bows. And then I'm going to insert a photo <clears throat> or video of my little fur baby with her bows on. Thanks for watching. Bye.